morning and on today's adventure we're gonna go remove a beehive from my friend's airboat camp I think we even have to airboat to get to the campsite packing up my gear stoked about this see ya so we just pulled up Airboat. Oh, and Gary's just launching. So we got two boats today. Let's see if I can see if I can get him. This is what we're here to remove, and they are boiling out of the floor. We're gonna get to work. Yeah, I meant to bring that. Right. <laughs> Open over the. Uh... Part of our reason why we came out here on the airboat so that we can remove this hive. We're just getting started.
bees can still lay. Right, if the queen is absent, the worker bees in the last chance to save the hive, hive will, uh, will start laying eggs. They didn't look like they were dying. <laughs> no, but they won't at that point. Like they still had brood the last day. So they're not gonna know, they're not gonna really truly start acting queenless until, like you see all the fact that it has so many drones indicates that it was cycling too. Mm -hmm. so a lot of drones, very little eggs, only the adult stage of larva, instead of having all of the stages throughout the hive, is a pretty big indicator that it might not be a queen. The camera girl is allergic to bees, so we had to drop her off. But we've gotten the queen and the brood here secured in this nuke box. We're gonna relocate it to the bee farm.